Hello everyone, I am the host of the YouTube channel Wang Yiba Inc. Sub. Nice to meet you again. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the hottest news of the day. And here's today's news. Zhang Zhijian born in the 50s, Wang Jinsong born in the 60s, and Chen Xia born in the 80s, who is in charge of acting in Ice Rain and Fire. This summer's hit drama can be said to have a variety of themes. They do has splendid star, Dong Fang Xuan Wan has King Lin Zhu. As for the suspense theater, it was contracted by Wang Yubo's Ice Rain and Fire. From the current point of view, the popularity and word of Mouth of Ice Rain and Fire have far exceeded the audience's expectations. In addition to the thrilling plot blessing, of course, it is inseparable from the successful shaping of the actors. After all, as the subject matter of the main drama, this drama can be said to be ruthless. From the perspective of the cast, the age of the actors in Ice Rain and Fire is extremely wide. It's hard to say who is the acting person in Ice Rain and Fire. Top 7, Wang Nebo. August 5, 1997 Speaking of Wang Yibo, the audience's impression of him has always been a traffic idol. He is full of charm in hip, hop variety shows, but as an actor, there is still a lot of room for improvement. But the audience never expected that Wang Yibo in The Wind Rises in Luo Young was also questioned by the original lines. But he in Ice, Rain and Fire has successfully amazed the audience. The role of Chen Yu he portrayed in the play is brave and full of justice. When Ice Rain and Fire was just launched, the most out of the circle was Chen Yu, the reckless man who was born from a calf and was not afraid of tigers. In terms of character, Wang Yubo's shaping has torn off the traffic label, allowing the audience to see his strength. Top 6, Yan Xiao Jie January 30, 1970 Actor Yan Xiao Jie portrayed a once majestic lingling in ice, rain, and fire, but in an accident, the captain of the anti-drug team, Gong Team, who is disabled for life, is left behind. Because of Wu Zhenfeng's interference with the operation, he also became a victim of this arrest. From an anti-drug captain to an ordinary worker guarding the gate of the police station. Every time Yan Xiaojie comes on stage, the author has an inexplicable sadness. In him, the audience can see the honesty and conscientiousness of an old policeman, but at the same time, we can also see a hero from the past who had to face the reality helplessly after experiencing the vicissitudes of life. Every time, when Yan Xiaojie stood guard in front of the door to let people in and out, the audience couldn't help but feel sour. Top 5, Gong Lei November 27, 1974 Gong Lei, an actor born in the 1970s, is also an old acquaintance of the audience. It can be seen from his face. 9 out of 10 characters he has created are villains. In Ice Rain and Fire, his brother is indeed a ruthless character. In the play, he is the only drug dealer with his own independent transportation line, and Gong Lei's performance, it even made Dong Jizora of not being ruthless and talking too much to his death. People fight and kill, he is an iceberg face that has nothing to do with him, and directly fills the sense of sight of the villain who is as stable as Mount Tai. Top 4 Wang Xiu Zhu June 10, 1993 Sister Chong played by actor Wang Xiu Zhu, although she is a woman, but it has a strong presence in ice, rain and fire from a male perspective. She is so beautiful in the play, in the lens, there are always big waves with big red lips, not to mention the beauty is very aggressive, and the setting of the role of the villain is stable. Of course, in addition to her own charm, Wang Xiu's performance, it is also inseparable from the character setting. In domestic dramas, there are not many stunning villains themselves. It is even rarer in this kind of drama, style anti-drag theme. And Wang Xu's performance is rare in domestic dramas, let alone even in ice, rain and fire with a cool lighting style, there is a sudden and hot beauty that catches the audience's attention. Top 3, Chen Xiao July 5, 1987 As a post, 80s generation in ice, rain, and fire, Chen Xiao gave the audience a surprise in the play, really brilliant. Compared with the living Yama in Mengualu, Wu Zhenfeng, played by Chen Xiao, first made a breakthrough in modeling, completely tore off the label of a white, face niche on himself, and appeared in the image of a sloppy rough man. As for the character setting, Wu Zhenfeng is alert and gloomy. He walks on the edge of black and white, pulling back and forth with the police and the gangsters. And Chen Xiao's shaping, it even presents the feeling of addict to the extreme, with a hunched body with a cynical attitude. Compared with Wang Yibo, who has a particularly positive aura, Chen Xiao's character image completely got rid of the previous portrayal of male protagonists in domestic dramas. Now that I think about it, the role of Wu Zhenfeng is fortunately shaped by Chen Xiao. Only he can perform the crushing feeling of such extreme pulling. Only him, 
He can combine cynicism and seriousness so naturally, especially when he vents his emotions. When he confessed to Chin Yu, he was angry and roaring, and every second of his tough appearance showed his loneliness. It's no wonder that Chin Xiao became the most distressed character in the whole drama as soon as Ice, Rain and Fire was launched. Top 2 Zhang Zhejian October 5, 1955 Actor Zhang Zhejian is definitely a senior in Ice Rain and Fire. In terms of character image, Zhang Zhejian is particularly suitable for roles such as officials and leaders. His acting skills are delicate and steady, and he can always shape the feeling of the hall in the hall. In Ice, Rain, and Fire, he even showed the courage of the deputy team of Chen. Although he doesn't have many roles, as soon as he appears on the stage, his eyes can reveal the coldness. For example, when he questioned Lin Dozen, played by Wang Jinsong, he had few lines. But the eyes seem to be able to be aggressive, making people hold their breath. Top 1, Wang Jinsong November 15, 1967 As soon as Ice, Rain and Fire was launched, the audience began to be suspicious of Lin Dozen, the character played by Wang Jinsong. When he appeared, Wang Jinsong was the director of the Public Security Bureau. But in the face of his immediate boss, Deputy Chief Chin, he was always hesitant to say anything and kept secrets. Even in the plot of the first episode, with the advancement of the plot clues, many netizens began to suspect that the show released the big boss of the whole show in the first episode. In addition to his suspenseful sense of suspense, Wang Jinsong also made the audience feel his relaxed and well, balanced life. For example, when he was playing against Wang Yibo, director Chin was always troubled by Chin Yu who couldn't understand the wink and was very reckless. And Wang Jinsong's helplessness every time he faces Wang Yibo and the way he tries to hold back his curses, all make the dramatic tension of the plot more interesting. Facing his boss, Wang Jinsong was the same. Facing a restless and difficult subordinate like Chin Yu, he cherishes talents and has a headache and his tight and loose performances show Wang Jinsong's delicateness in shaping the characters. All in all, the quality of the drama Ice Rain and Fire is not only reflected in the exciting and intense plot, the production with outstanding texture is inseparable from the wonderful shaping of the actors. The protagonist's acting is strong, the highlights of the supporting roles are endless. In Ice Rain and Fire, the audience can not only see the achievements of the plot, but also the mutual achievements of the actors and the characters. What is even more rare is that the cast of Ice, Rain and Fire has gathered all age groups. There are post-90s, post-80s, and post-70s and post-50s. Their interpretation experience is different. The acting skills are not at the same level at all. But they were cast as a whole, clinging to each other, without any one character holding back. In a word, the brilliance of Ice Rain and Fire lies in the careful shaping of each character and the integrity of the actor's acting skills.